Hey! This <laughs> man is in there, man. Blue Speed has in there, too. Yes, Blue Speed. Yes, man, just not Magus, okay? Because I like the way it sounds better. Any sweat. I wanted to talk to you. <laughs> Keep doing that. I don't mean to do that on purpose. Um, it just happens. So I wanted to talk about Uber. Not about Uber, but about a specific part of Uber, a specific service. And it's, it is cool. Uh, and you know you might it might lean more towards pool express um i don't think a lot of people know this what is pool what is pool express pool generally is a shared ride you share with other people you are supposed to minimize the time that you um meet with the ride okay in a pool because you are impacting other riders, right? So, you know, be considerate of other people uh, when you choose to share ride. Share pool does not mean what a lot of people think it means is oh, this is the cheapest ride. It don't just mean no, it's the cheapest ride. It means it's a shared ride, like I said before. It's not just a cheap ride. It's cheap for a reason. And that reason is because you are, again, sharing with other people who you should be considerate of. Okay? So, in that thing, let's, and let's talk about pool, uh, that's pool rides in general, but it's specifically a pool express, right? Pool Express, and it's not all your fault. I'm not saying it's all the riders' fault. Some of it's um, the the software mapping problem. Uh, Pool Express is supposed to be kind of like a bus route. You know, you go to stops, you pick up people who have walked to the stop, <laughs> who are waiting at the stop. Okay, that's what a Pool Express is. You pick up people who are waiting for you at the stop on your route, right? It's not go find somebody. It's not go get somebody. It's not go call somebody. It's, that's not what it is. It, it is not just, oh, cheapest ride, let me do that, okay? <clears throat> so when you go on a pool express, you're supposed to be at the spot to be picked up. The Pool Express will tell you where the spot is. I know. I'm, I've been a rider for a long time. A rider and a driver. You know, I did riding. I'm not stupid. It means <laughs> that you're supposed to get your boogie your booty over there to the spot. And you're supposed to be there. When the driver gets there, okay? Otherwise, the driver, a lot of drivers are just going to cancel and take your money. That's what a lot of drivers are going to do. And they should do that because you didn't meet your obligation. Now, what a Pool Express is not, is not an Uber Express ride or, or above. It's not Uber Comfort, none of that. It is not a ride where somebody drives half a mile inside your apartment complex to find you and waits outside oh has to call you to wake you up let you know oh i'm here that's an uber that's an uber x ride you're getting it mixed up with uber with pool express an uber x ride an uber just for you that's a just for you ride just for you ride is when we come and find you and even then, it's, all, it's up to a limitation, you know. I'm not going to drive five miles away to find you, all right? So, you got to know the difference. And then, you know, don't just click on the thing because it's cheap. 
that is not just the purpose. Yeah, it's cheap, but there's a reason why it's cheap. Because you are supposed to walk some and get to the spot to be picked up. Okay? Now, right now, Uber does allow people who live in these gigantic uh, gated communities to choose Uber Express. I don't know why they allow that, but maybe hopefully that'll change. I mean, I know you, if you live in those places, you don't want that to change. <laughs> but it's not very um, it's not very convenient to other riders or the driver to be driving inside, the, and it's, and that's not part of a route. You know, when you you're going all the way in somewhere. And then you got to come all the way out the same way you came in. That is not a route. A route is just continuously going on the shortest line possible. Okay? But that's not, that's why I say that's not your fault. That's Uber. Is uh, That's a flaw in Uber's design. And, you know, they should create something else to uh, accommodate people who live in those types of areas. But we really shouldn't be driving deep inside of some gated community, you know, going up to the gate, you go know, half the time, you know, you, you can't get in the gate. You have to call somebody. They got to give us the right code. They'll be like, 938. They say, no, pound 938. Uh, 938 star. 938 uh, pound star. Press the button. Do the hokey pokey and you move yourself around. Then drive in there. Oh, no, I'm further in. No, make a left or right or right or left or left or right or right and go by the trash can and by the pool and by the community center and then turn the left and then go back out and come back in. No, we shouldn't be doing that on a pool or a pool express. We shouldn't really be doing that at all. But our mapping software, as a lot of riders don't seem to understand, is not the greatest. <laughs> it's not the greatest, but that's a whole other subject. Point is, I just want you to understand what a pool is, okay? Please, if you see this, be aware and tell your friends what a pool and a pool express is because a lot of people just don't have it right. And it's very frustrating and irritating and inconsiderate to the riders and the driver to have to go through all this extra crap because somebody doesn't know what they're doing when they press that button, okay? So thank you very much for listening. Have a nice day. Be safe out there. Peace in your hood. <laughs>